Hi friends, welcome back to Drew Tutorial and if you're new, a special welcome to you. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to add passwords or how to save passwords within your Edge browser. Before we jump in guys, would you mind taking a moment to give this video a like and hit that subscribe button because this will let me know that you found value within this video. And on top of that, the biggest benefit is that you'll never miss out when I release future videos just like this one. Now let's continue. So I'm going to head over to Amazon as an example. I'm going to type in Amazon.de here. And once I'm at Amazon, I'm going to simply go ahead and sign in. So I'm going to translate this into English just for the purpose here so I can understand it. And I'm going to click in my accounts in the upper right there, then click on hello, sign in, enter my email address, click on continue, and I'm going to enter the password, right? Now, once I enter my password, I'm going to click sign in and you will see that I have a pop-up ask me if I want to save the password. And as you can see here, I can simply go ahead and click and got it. And if that's allow me to save the password or I can choose not now if I don't want to, but I'm going to click and got it and save the password. So this is how you can save it by visiting a website. Now, if you want to do this like manually or to edit the password that you already saved, all you have to do, just simply click the three dots here in the upper right hand side and then you want to click on settings now under the profile here just scroll down to the bottom slightly scroll and you will see passwords so click in passwords and here you will find a list of all the passwords that you've saved in the past so you can easily go ahead and scroll through manually if you have let's say not a lot of passwords or if you have quite a lot of passwords like myself here i would suggest that you use the search to go ahead and search for it so you can simply search so for example i saved the amazon one i can type in amazon and as you can see it finds a bunch of them and i can click on the amazon de for example and it will ask me for my windows password right because it requires administrative privilege and from here you can see i have the option to edit it and also to delete it so let's say i want to edit it i can click edit and i can change my email address, the password, and even the category and app, and even to add a note. So I can say, for example, shopping here, and let's say the password, I want to go ahead and change it to something, I can do it, and then click on done. Now, let's say I want to delete it, I can simply go ahead and hit the delete button here, and it will delete it for me. And I can simply go ahead, as you can see, I can quickly undo it quickly if I want to restore back that password. So if I want to restore it, I can click undo, and quickly, as you can see, it is back. But I'm going to delete this for the purpose. Now, if you want to see back all of those passwords that you have before, as you can see, because I use a search to filter this, you can simply click on the passwords again on the left hand side, and it will start to show all of those passwords. And from here, you can simply go ahead and find whatever you have here, and you can click on delete and just start to delete passwords if you so desire. And that's all there is to it, guys. Very easy and very simple. Here you have it, guys. I really hope you found value within this video. And if you do, don't forget to take a moment to give this video a like and hit that subscribe button so that you'll never miss out when I release future videos just like this one. Thank you guys for watching and see you next time.